So Western Nurseries is participating in the uh, Jimmy Fund Walk. Uh, we do it, this is probably our 10th or 11th year, and each year our team grows a little more. We've got a lot of employees walking. We've got six walkers this year. We've had up to 12 in the past. Uh, our goal is to raise $12,500 in this year's Jimmy Fund Walk, which is uh, a little more than what we raised last year. Um, Certainly would love it if people went on to the Jimmy Fund Walk homepage, found the Western Nurseries team, and, and made a donation. You can still do that 30 days after the race. So the race is this Sunday, um, September 25th. It's a funny thing. Nobody even knows it goes through Hopkinton. There's about 8,000 walkers. Some of them don't do the whole Boston Marathon distance route, but most of them do, and they start off behind Center School, and most people wake up. They're all gone by 7 o'clock. It's still dark when we, when we start takes us usually about seven even closer to eight hours to do that walk and you are sore as heck the next day uh, the funniest thing is when you get off the bus when the bus drives you back to Hopkinton <laughs> you can hardly move so it's it's a tough feat uh, especially those last five or six miles uh, we do it because we think the Jimmy Fund is absolutely one of the best run charitable organizations uh, in the area or in the country uh, they donate just about all the proceeds to the patients um, uh, helping the patients who have cancer, but also for cancer research. They've made so much progress uh, here in Boston uh, with the contributions not only from this, uh, but the uh, Pan Mass bike race as well. These are their two biggest fundraisers. The Jimmy Fund um, uh, Walk raises, I believe, about $8 million every year with about the 8,000 walkers uh, that do it. So uh, we'd enjoy everybody uh, participating uh, as a walker or making a donation that, that can and we welcome that and um, we also do some things at Christmas for the Jimmy Fund when we get pictures with Santa you can donate five bucks at that time and I think we're going to do a coffee uh, offering in our garden center now where you can leave a buck for the Jimmy Fund there too so a lot of ways that you can contribute.